Hi, uh, I'm Devnold. Uh, I'm going to talk to you about Back to the Future. Uh, I was just uh, 10 years old when I saw uh, Back to the Future. Um, for a 10 year old me, it was one of the best things I saw at the time. Uh, the possibility of going to the past to correct something in your life, to be able to go and see the future, what the future holds. If only I could do that in real life. It's been over 30 years since the first Back to the Future came out. I'm still amazed by how Marty McFly goes to the future to get his parents together. It's a great idea. According to most scientists in the field, it is theoretically possible, yet we are long way from making this into a reality. In order to travel through time, one would have to go to the future faster than the speed of light, which is impossible. As you are aware, our technology is decades, if not centuries, away from there. The thing with the time travel is that we could only go forward in time. It would be a one-way trip. All, said, all that said, if you were given a chance to go to the future, would you? Would you want to leave all your loved ones behind? Never see them again? Or would you go to the future and make a reboot that explains why a teenager, teenage boy is friends with an old scientist? Looking at Marty's character, he can, uh, he's just an average guy who just happens to get this opportunity. His first reaction is to save his dad to get getting hit by a car. Uh, I would do the same thing uh, if I were in his shoes. However, that would be a really complicated matter in real life. As you are aware, there are multiple things that could happen. His parents could have never married. They could have, his parents could have died. The future is not set in stone. We all have an option to choose our own destiny. We all have said at one time or the other, if I only knew then what I knew now, things would be better. Hindsight is always twenty twenty. There is another working theory that suggests past, present and future have already happened except we just experience it in a linear manner. How does free will fall into this? To tell me what would you think? Is our understanding of time skewed by our perspective? 